Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, thank you for watching and please subscribe. But um, today I am now 11 weeks out from my competition and I am feeling a little bit leaner each day. And last week I was dropping um, like scale weight I call it because sometimes I'll look skinny but I like gained weight according to the scale. So the scale number went down a couple pounds in the last week because I was really really pushing myself and I think it was had to do with um, two things. One, my coach up my cardio and two because I really really wanted to earn my cheat meal that I get today. Um, I really pushed myself in the gym to the point where I was like dying like le legit dying. Um, Anyways, and also I was kind of trying to add less, like if I usually put mustard on something, I was trying to add less mustard and salsa, etc. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to get right into a Jed North haul. First, I have this t-shirt that I wore a few times already, but I really, really like this. I like these t-shirts in general because they're just like cropped and it's kind of cute and whatnot, but... Obviously, obviously I would get a t-shirt that's supposed to be like kind of towards like a mean girls theme But anyways, there's this one. I really really like it. I'm just gonna bring the box a little closer <laughs> Okay, and the next thing Is another t-shirt except this one's lighter. Ooh, that one's gonna look so good. I really like these colors I love anything that's like light pastels um, and like more pop colors kind of thing but then yeah I got this one as well <laughs> if you guys know me you're just kind of like uh you know actually who this would be good for my younger sister Darcy she's obsessed with french fries but um like who isn't but anyways yeah I got another t-shirt I got these honestly because if you're like me on prep um you just start forgetting shit like I don't know, shaving your armpits, like, I, I know that's like TMI, but sometimes I'll get to the gym after work and I'm like, fuck me, I don't have a fucking razor or something, so it's a lot better to just like have a little t-shirt in your bag, so I wanted to get some of those. Um, speaking of hygiene, I should have washed my hair this morning and I experimented with something I used to do in high school that was like putting baby powder on your hair um, and I stopped doing that because it dried out my scalp and like who the fuck wants dandruff so anyways that is why my hair might look a bit blonder okay the next thing is um, something that I kind of wanted to do if I was doing group classes while I stop so close um, group classes because sometimes when I go to like another gym or something I don't want to be wearing a sports bra as my top so I got something that wouldn't be hot but um you know like or even if I'm volunteering in the summer my community does some volunteering and stuff so if I go to the community center and like really do anything or if I'm just outside um and like raking the fucking leaves or something um yeah, I just thought that would be a really cute tank top to kind of have that's like an athletic top. I can sweat in it, but it's not like boobies. I don't even have boobs. I'm not someone that can say that. Okay, the next thing I got was another tank top. Um, yeah, so basically I wanted just like more white and stuff like that for more like casual days. Because some days I don't want my stomach to be showing if I'm like done work and like just feeling blah one day. I like to throw on this, but I don't want like my long sleeve and stuff like that because obviously girl's gonna fucking die on the Stairmaster in a long sleeve right now. But um, yeah, so I just got that. It's probably gonna get fake tanner on it the second I put it on. So uh, probably shouldn't have got it, but whatever. Um, and then the next thing I got, yes, I love like anything that's like spring colors. That's cute. Yeah, I love it. I love that. Okay, so as you saw in my last video, I got all of those little tank tops and I've been wearing them like crazy. So um, if you follow me, then yeah, this one kind of seems a little bigger, but I'll definitely have to try it on to find out. And it feels almost like different material. Um, it very well could be. I have no idea. I'm not looking at the material like information tag. Oh yeah, okay, and the other thing isn't actually, um, 
workout wear, like it's not clothing, but I am traveling a little bit at the end of the um, month. So I got this because I wanted to put my meal preps in it and I got this lunch bag or like cooler, I guess you could say. I definitely thought it was gonna be a little bit different, but it's a pretty decent size. So I can definitely fit um, quite a few meal preps on one side and then on the other side, if I wanted to put um, either like an ice pack or wa like water or like ketchup, like sugar-free ketchup, like I don't know. I really don't know. I don't know guys. The options are just whew, so much to talk about. Okay. And then I have this little pocket because I probably put like an extra spoon or something in there. That's one thing about me is, <coughs> oh God, sorry is when I will eat my meals out, like today, let's say it's Saturday, I'm obviously gonna bring one of my lunch meals out with me for the day. I'm sorry, I'm like ADHD, I can't hold anything or else I'm like fiddling with it. But um, basically half of the time I bring my lunch out and about with me, I don't have a fucking spoon or a fork so many times. I went to get a coffee at Timmy's or McDonald's or anywhere and like, as I'm like, oh, thank you so much, can I have a fork? <laughs> They're kind of just like, what the fuck does this bitch need a fork for? She got coffee, for fuck's sakes. Anyways, oh yeah, look at that, a little like cooler wall, so, or like, just to keep it, you know, meh, divided a little bit. Oh, no way! I actually didn't even know I got these. I got a bunch of meal prep containers. Oh, that's nice. Yay. That's really nice because obviously to go with that, but I can even bring these somewhere. So when I go away, um, if I want to just like bring boxes with me, bring some snacks out for the day. I got this one as well. Um, is this two liters? Let me look. 2.2 liter water bottle. So yeah, there is a good water bottle. That way if I am out and about, it's nicer to have a bigger water bottle. Okay guys, so my battery is probably gonna just stop because I can see the temperature warning coming on. But um, I also got a regular size shaker from Judd North. So thank you so much Judd North for another shaker. I decided to go to a different good life than I am used to and I'm gonna be alone and what was the other thing oh yeah it's basically just gonna be cardio and then a couple other exercises so I'm thinking I'm just gonna leave my camera here and I'm not gonna film my workout today I think I'll film my workout tomorrow when um, I'm at my regular gym because I don't know I kind of like get more anxiety and stuff like that so I don't really want to be like carrying my camera around a gym and like you know what I mean? I'm supposed to have my cheat meal tonight, but I'm pretty sure what I'm gonna do instead of having like a traditional cheat meal, AKA like going out for sushi um, or in general, just like going out, I think what I'll do is cook French fries, not French fries, but like, ugh. oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God. <laughs> so many things in my, I have two bags on each arm. But um, I think what I'm gonna do is just cook sweet potato fries in my air fryer and cook a lot of them. And I think I'm gonna cook um, either like a stuffed chicken recipe or um, fajitas or something that I would normally really, really like if I was off prep. For the grocery haul! <laughs> First we got our fish. <laughs> I think this one, I don't even know. This, I saw this little speck. 
on my fish, and I don't know if that means it's bad. Mom, if you don't want your invasion of privacy, don't film me. Don't look at my phone. <laughs> oh, sorry guys. The camera's gonna land. She likes her privacy. <laughs> until my memory card's full. Let's do the what's in my grocery bag haul. <laughs> we got our asparagus. How many do you use? Some backup greens, Mom, just in case. Mom, I stop. Some backup greens, just in case. I run out of asparagus throughout the week. And then two sweet potatoes. These are actually just for tonight for my cheat meal. I think I'm gonna make sweet potato fries and stuffed chicken or a stir fry or something for my meal, for my cheat meal tonight. So yeah, that's all I got at my grocery store. So done. <laughs> I'm just cooking my like veggies now. And this is the first time I cooked them in the air fryer. So I cooked my asparagus in the air, or how did I do that? I boiled my asparagus and then I put them in the air fryer for a bit and I put them in a couple of times and they kind of just look like this now. So I think what I'm gonna do is fry them in my pan like I normally do for a bit and just kind of let them crisp and then I'm gonna season them just so they're really good for the nights when I actually eat my asparagus it'll taste super good so another thing I did was peeled my sweet potatoes and then cut them into pieces this big boiled them a bit and I'm gonna use the air fryer for those now and just make sweet potato fries for my meal prep nights but I'm also gonna put it on the side of my cheat meal kind of tonight So I'm just sitting down for my cheat meal and I'm just gonna watch some YouTube on my TV while I do it but I just wanted to quickly show you the end result I put pineapple almonds broccoli the brown rice noodles that I was showing you guys and then chicken and yeah, then I made the peanut sauce and I think I might have some sweet potatoes in like half an hour just to have a little bit more like the french fries. <laughs> but yeah, that's my cheat meal for like my at home cheat meal. I wanted to show you guys just what I do to make my oatmeal a little bit more. Um, so basically I do 40 grams of just regular Quaker oatmeal and then I put protein in it but what I do to like make it less watery because I put a lot of water in it is I will put my plate on top of it and now because like that's like really thick usually if I put the same amount of water in and um, I don't know where good lighting is usually if I put the same amount of water in with that amount of oatmeal it's like really watery um but because you like trap the like moist like the heat or whatever in it like obviously absorbs more water and like makes it bigger oh my god i don't know how to explain this but you guys know what i mean i also wanted to show you guys kind of like what's in my lunch bag and what i bring to work every day so i started using my two liter actually it's 2.2 liter i also bought two of these little sugar-free um like flavored water drops and then I have my lunch and I have 
my sugar-free energy drink, which I don't always have, but I bought it at the grocery store when I bought those drops. Um, and sometimes I'll put in a little bit of cucumber or red pepper on the side, but that's only like sometimes. Like <laughs> If I'm noticing I've been really hungry at work or something, um, I will do so, but usually I try not to have like peppers or something throughout the day. Mm -hmm. 